So you might be trying to figure out how you can actually back up your Samsung Galaxy phone. Now, there are many ways to go about doing this. You can do a manual backup. You can do a backup to a PC or computer, whatever you have. But you can also back up via your Samsung phone. And also, if you're coming from an older Samsung phone, you can just transfer your data to that new phone without having to back anything up. Now, the way to do this is by going through and making your way over to your settings application. So when you come over to your settings app, it will then come into this specific page. Now, what you're going to want to do here is you want to tap on the search bar that's right above your profile icon right here. So tap on your search bar and you'll come into this page. Now, what you're going to want to do here is you want to go ahead and type in backup. So type in backup. It's a pretty easy way to type it in and you'll see a few things. The first thing is you can bring your data from an old device, but in this case, we're not going to do that. You can do an external storage backup or a temporary cloud backup if you want to. So you can tap on temporary cloud backup and you will see this specific panel come up. Now it says backup unlimited data to Samsung cloud for up to 30 days or restore data you've backed up. So what you can do is if you have a phone that's suitable with this, you can just tap on this specific thing and essentially it'll bring you straight into your Samsung members application. So your Samsung account, you can go on, if you don't already have one, just sign up. I just, it's just kind of a sign up process, kind of annoying, but sign in with Google or sign into your account. And then what's going to happen is it'll go, basically allow you to back up your, all the data on your Samsung phone onto Samsung cloud servers. And then within 30 days, if you're switching over to another phone, you can just go ahead and transfer all your data from that cloud backup into your actual phone by restoring it. And that's pretty much all you're going to have to do. It really is that basic of a process. Now you can test that out and see if that works for you. If that doesn't work, you can do one of these other methods. You can do a backup to Google Drive. You can backup data again to Samsung Cloud. And you can even use Smart Switch, like I mentioned before, which allows you to you know, switch over from your Samsung phone to another one if you want to. But that's basically how it's done. It's a very basic process. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that'll be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.